Welcome to Rainbow Network Media. Please kindly subscribe to this channel for interesting news. Thank you all for listening. Senator Shehu Sani, who represented Kaduna Centra in the 8th National Assembly, has expressed skepticism over allegations that the late founder of NASCO Group, manufacturers of the popular NASCO conflicts, Ahmed Idris Nasruddin, was part of those posturing terrorism in the North. A freelance investigative journalist, David Hondey, had published a finding that the late NASCO boss, alongside some other prominent Northern figures, was allegedly financing some regional terrorism, including Boko Haram. Reacting to the allegation in a post on his official Facebook page, the former lawmaker expressed doubt on the report, stating that more facts are still needed to convince the general public. The post reads, It's doubtful that a reputable company like NASCO that has contributed immensely to the industrial and economic development of the North and Nigeria as a whole, provided employment opportunities for thousands, assisted families, and for decades remained steadfast in the face of our political security and economic challenges can now be accused of funding terrorism. More facts are needed. Otherwise, let's not destroy those who believe and still stand with us while others have left for long. So guys, uh, Senator Shehu Sani, who represented uh, the Kaduna Centra in the 8th National Assembly, said he is not uh, in support of the findings that was done that the NASCO boss is part of those financing terrorism and Boko Haram in Nigeria, especially in the North. Senator Shehu Sani said more facts is needed to prove that uh, that the NASCO boss uh, the, oh, that's the owner of NASCO Group, manufacturer of uh, popular NASCO conflicts, Ahmed Idris Nasruddin, was part of those sponsoring terrorism in the North. He said Moffat has to prove it, otherwise uh, it means it can't not be true. So guys, what do you think concerning uh, this news? Please let us know by dropping your comment at the comment section. And please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more updates. Thank you all for listening.